No, hello, hello. Sir David the Bard. I had to put a pillow on, Anna. I don't like to get dressed much anymore. Why? <laughs> Why? Just to be on here. Anyway, Sir David the Bard. I'm coming to you out of uh, Kangaroo City, my hometown. And um, a lot of you have written in. Just means I'm lying. <laughs> Many of you have written in and uh, have asked, um, how did I uh, <coughs> get out of the Mormon Church? Well, it wasn't easy. And um, I happened to have a link down below uh, when I was younger. And um, a lot of things are a lot easier to get into in life uh, than get out of. And uh, the link down below is basically showing how I, I was struggling to get out of the Mormon Church. It took years, and it took uh, a lot of education. It took a lot of reading. It took a lot of uh, suffering. It took a lot of a lot of. So anyway, I want you to enjoy this uh, day after Christmas, uh, day after Christmas down here in Kangaroo City. Um, I unwrapped a, a couple of new kangaroos. I told you the presents were hopping under the tree, and the kids thought that was bitching. They go, God dang, Dad, you're cool. <laughs> not cool it's just a couple of new kangaroos for you so anyway uh, the kids are out there still playing with them under the tree and uh, boy there's a mess on the floor and I don't mean <laughs> wrapping paper if you know what I mean anyway <clears throat> take a look down below watch me try to get out of the Mormon church and watch uh, what a struggle it really was it is easier to get into a cult than get out of a cult so please don't slit my throat cut my heart out cut my gut open, don't pay me, lay me, or air me, and oh God, hear the words of my mouth, uh, don't do any of that, and uh, I hope uh, for the new year you have a health and enable me, or the bonus, strength and ways of saints, power and priesthood be upon me, upon my posterity through all generations of time, and throughout all eternity, take a look at the link, me getting out of the Mormon church was not that easy.